Welcome back to Marlow Middle School Nation, also known as MMN. Today we're dedicating this episode to Epilepsy Awareness Year. All around Marlow, students have been creating epilepsy awareness posters everywhere. In this episode of MMN, you'll learn what epilepsy is and how to help someone with it. Epilepsy is a neurological condition which results in seizures, but not every person will have the same symptoms or the same amount of symptoms. The brain has millions of nerve cells which control how we think, move, and feel. The nerve cells do this by sending electrical signals to the brain. Epilepsy happens when there are too many electrical signals that are being sent uh, through neural pathways or the nerve cells are being disrupted, which can result in seizures. But why are neur neurons behaving differently? If neurons are damaged, this might change how they normally work and affect how they send the signals. If there are too many or not enough neurotransmitters, this affects how the neurons communicate and can cause seizures. Some neurons may have different uh, synaptic receptors which receive the neurotransmitters, and this can make it harder for the neuron to stop or switch off the message. So the neuron continues to send the message even though it is not needed anymore. But there is no clear reason why seizures stop happening. A possible reason is that the brain realizes that it is having a seizure and sends out chemicals or signals in order to stop the process. Some other symptoms of epilepsy include fainting or fatigue, rhythmic muscle contractions or muscle spasms, seizures, amnesia, anxiety, depression, headaches, sleepiness, staring spells, or temporary paralysis after a seizure. Fun fact, there was an episode of Pokemon that caused children to have seizures and epilepsy because of the fast motion and movement of the lights. Also, most types of video games have warnings that this game may cause epilepsy for the same reason. This shows how epilepsy can be caused through a variety of things, such as games, TV, and other media can cause the most commonly known cause of epilepsy, which is flashing lights. Wait, no, the yeah, the flashing lights. And now, what do you do if you see someone having a seizure or other signs of epilepsy? Well... Epilepsy can be a really bad thing. It can really make the whole world sting. If you want to help someone who's having a seizure, keep the crowd away, don't be a creature. Place them on their side so they have air, call 911 if it goes aware. They'll probably start shaking so clear the way, clear sharp objects they can live another day. But don't strain them cause that's a bad plan, get out of the way before things hit the fan. But stay with them, don't run away, reassure them, and tell them that it's okay. And lastly, do not be a loser, help out the world, don't be a 